On the 10th of December 2019, Dr. Daniel excised a large earwart in a dwarf hamster and followed up with the stitching of the wound. Unfortunately, the stitches have since disappeared and the hamster has been noticed to persistently paw at his right ear. Is it possible that the stitches have got themselves into the ear canal? The owner asked. With a very itchy right ear, just what is the problem? This is a Be Kind to Pets veterinary educational video sponsored by Topayo Vets. Note that viewer's discretion is advised. To address the issue, an electrosurgery was conducted. An electrosurgery typically involves the use of a high-frequency alternating polarity current to make incisions in tissues. In this particular case, the right vertical ear canal was opened up by electroincision. The hamster was put under general anesthesia using isoflurane and oxygen, following which the ear canal was opened up vertically. The hamster was then examined and fluid was discovered to be present inside the ear canal. Ear drops were used to drain out any stitch remnants. The hamster's other large wart lower down on its face was also cut off and stitched up with 5-0 absorbable sutures. As can be seen in the video, electrosurgery is highly effective in preventing bleeding after excision of the wart and also during the opening of the ear canal. An alternative method would be to use a scalpel blade but there would likely be profuse bleeding from blood vessels on the skin. This video here was taken on the 19th of December 2019, 4 hours after the electrosurgery. As can be seen here, the hamster has since fully recovered from anesthesia. He would therefore be sent home on the 20th of December 2019. For more information, do visit topiovets.com and once again, thanks for watching.